to the second installment of our virtual passport video series. Today, you'll hear from one of the top organizations in China that has been instrumental in protecting national wildlife through tireless legal work, China Biodiversity Conservation and Green Development Foundation. Let's hear from them now. This is John Atian from the China Biodiversity Conservation and Green Development Foundation. Our job is pretty self-explanatory as we are one of China's leading biodiversity organization. Uh, we was originated from the Milu Deer introduction in 1985. There's about uh, 50 staff and thousands of registered volunteers nationwide. And I will introduce you how China is alive from our own perspective. Uh, we speak Chinese with complex characteristics, and uh, the majority of us are anxious. And our country used to export cheap manual labor. And now things have changed. And I'd like to let you enjoy some of the photos we have taken from the Himalaya and Tibet. Uh, these are also the Arknai conservation areas we have set up. In order to preserve this beautiful scenery, we are also working on issues uh, concerning climate change. Uh, so we have proposed that each and every one of us has equal rights to carbon, uh, which is a reflection of most things we have done uh, about public participation. We think that in today's world we are facing three challenges, biodiversity loss, climate change, and public health crisis, uh, one of which is connected to another. For example, if we are facing a problem of losing habitat, then we will face greater risk on zootonic diseases. So I will tell you how CBC GDF is working on the relative issues. As you can see here, the climate change is infecting China in all sorts of ways. In order to solve this, we need to have all workers alive united and uh, change the situation of the carbon emissions and the carbon sequencing. To do that, we need to start with restoring the habitat. Here's a pic from the antelope conservation areas in Tibet we have set up. There are 176 CCEFAs across China. All the volunteers are protecting homes, which uh, gives them a sense of belonging and works for the greater good. As for more public awareness campaigns, uh, in 2019, we started the uh, activity of saying no to plastic covers, which changed thousands of schools' practice of using plastics to cover the books. We have also been filing public interest legislation ever since 2015. Uh, we have stopped the contamination of the uh, dessert deserts of rivers and mines. We have also been putting an end to public smoking and uh, non-green, non-environmental friendly takeouts. And finally, we have been doing science popularity campaigns across the countries, raising awareness of both the youth and the children. We think we need to start with people, solve the grand problems. So if you are interested, uh, please contact us. And we wish the meeting goes the very best. Thank you. Thank you for watching the virtual passport video for CBC and GDF. To commemorate your symbolic travel to China, here is a stamp to add to your virtual passport. Stay sustainable.